Your Majesty, may I present to you the greatest detective of all time, Sherlock Holmes, and Dr. John Watson. I love you. Watson? Oh! Whew. What a looker, right? She is stunning. <gasps> My wife told me, throw out that gray draping. Throw it out. We don't need it. And I was like, no, no. No, no, no. I've been keeping this up for 15 years in storage. And look, it finally came to use. I got here early, and I was like, I know what we need. It's always good to have some gray black draping just Scorches. lying around the house. Yeah. <laughs> and I had my old lantern. <laughs> wow. Yeah. So I hung that. See fit that? Perfect. Your wife and, said, throw that out. And I'm and like, said, honey, this is going to come <laughs> in use. And sure, I cannot wait to rub it in her face when I get home. Guess what? That old lantern that you said was useless? There it is. It oh, you don't, deck. you don't think gray draping is going to yeah. be the main top of conversation oh, at dinner tonight? Just get ready. I'm going to put it around myself as I walk in the door. Oh. Guess what I did with this today? Yeah. Use it for my press junket. Uh huh. Solve this case in four days or I will kill the queen. Signed, Professor James Moriarty. Come, Watson. We have a killer to catch. Yeah. No shit, Sherlock! <laughs> Are you familiar with the term codependent? <laughs> uh, <laughs> they work through a lot of stuff in their relationship in this movie. And all the while, it devoted to Sherlock Holmes, seeking his approval at the same time. And burnishing his legacy. Holmes is oblivious to all of it on some level. Uh, only to kind of, you know, come full circle and realize how, how he's, he's taken this friendship and his expertise for granted. Majesty, would you mind if we had a picture together? Watson, who's going to take the photograph? I will take it. You see, it's sort of a self-photograph. He's a real fan. I swear, I never do this. Hey, girl! Hey, girl! If you like Sherlock Holmes, you can expect some really hilarious inside jokes regarding the canon of Sherlock Holmes. Um, and yeah, I think we were able else? to kind of split the difference between, you know, uh, being true to the style and the genre that you've come to expect, at the same time making fun of it, and and you know, so if you're well versed in it, you'll you'll get a kick out of jokes that that someone else who who doesn't have any knowledge of the characters will still have just as much fun. And yeah. it's set in a richly detailed yeah. period setting that's done as as well as. A movie company can do it. You know, we didn't, we didn't shortchange that just because it's a comedy. The movie is really rich and mm -hmm. great to look at, and it has you know a lot of ridiculous jokes. In it. And we sing musical number. Spoiler alert! Spoiler alert! Oh my God! Mother of shit!